Australia is on fire. Sea levels are rising more rapidly than previously thought. Since 1966, the lake's water has been receding. Climate change. Climate change. Climate change is real. I think we are experiencing climate change and the data supports it. Climate change, changes in the Earth's weather, especially the increase in the temperature of the Earth's atmosphere. In the past two years, this term has been heavily used in the media and has been debated by political leaders. When we usually think of it, we think of ice melting, forests burning and water levels rising. A lot of us don't really experience these effects firsthand, but what do all these things really mean for us? mankind. Let's try to answer this question by taking a look at the Lake Chad Basin, a region in Western Africa that stands at the forefront of the fight against climate change. Over the past 50 years, Lake Chad, a source of food and water for tens of millions of people, has lost over 90% of its volume due to climate change. In that same time frame, the local population tripled, making the lake an unsustainable food source. The food production became scarce for this now 30 million inhabit region. This crisis has led to the horrific levels of poverty across the region, culminating in the proliferation of the terrorist group Boko Haram and a generalized refugee crisis. So, let's go back to that initial question. What does this mean for us? If we don't do anything, climate change will not only affect remote ecosystems, but could directly cause the end of a stable society all across the world.